I wanted someone strong who could protect me I let his anger fester and infect me His solution is a lie No one here deserves to die Except for me and the monster So as you can tell by that intro, we got three top people in this competition. We got Ram Sweeney, who looks really depressed. We got Veronica Sawyer, Dead Girl Walking, and of course we got Judy. And you know what? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, like, okay, so I was going to leave Veronica dead, right? Because I was like, it's the Survivor Games. Oh, wait, who's that? Oh, hey, hey, Heather, how you doing? Anyway, so I was going to leave Veronica dead because, you know, it's the Survivor Games, you know, whatnot. It's like, hey, you know, she lost, so. But an overwhel I asked you guys an overwhelming amount of people. Some people did say leave her dead, but most of the people said to bring her back. And I can get that point because Veronica, I said it was a double death, and she was not supposed to die, and I was trying to save her, but she died accidentally. And you know what? It's kind of more fun to have three people compete right now than just Ram and JD. It gives Ram less of a chance of winning because we all know no one's rooting for Ram, right? Maybe. I think no one's rooting for Ram. I mean, I don't see anybody ever talking about Ram, okay? But if you are, show yourself. <laughs> anyway, so I was thinking, because we they're the top three, that I'm going to actually have them go out to a club or something to celebrate. Oh, it's 4 a.m. Never mind. Well, okay. Well, <laughs> maybe maybe I'll do the club thing later. Or, I mean, I would throw a party, but they don't have any friends outside of this, and everyone's kind of dead. You still, have the, I, you still have the ghost Veronica and the live Veronica, so we're just going to pretend this ghost Veronica doesn't exist. So, if you saw her gravestone missing in the little like little intro that i did it's because i released i released the ghost veronica spirit and then i got rid of the tombstone so she gone <laughs> so this is the only veronica we're just gonna say this is veronica back from the dead so you know what how about we just have a, like a little bonfire or something for the top three maybe roast some marshmallows or whatever they've never used this i think some people use this and I know everybody uses this and sometimes that, but they've never used this like little bonfire thing. You can change the fire color? Ooh. Fun fact, my favorite color is orange. <laughs> I don't know a lot of people whose favorite color is orange. And I can kind of get why, because orange can be kind of an eyesore, like yellow, but eh. I still love it. So, we'll just have them all hang out. I think, you know, despite the intro of them looking like enemies, I think they're actually all friends. Well, sort of. Veronica's relationship's reset, so. But. I think Ram and JD are friends, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, they're friends. And then they're just getting to know Veronica because, you know, she's back from the dead. It would be nice if it was nighttime, but it's like 5 a.m., so that's awkward. So I guess that was a nice five minutes. You know what? We'll just have them all go to like a park or something. I don't know. For the first time in Survivor Games history, I'm going to unlock this door. And we're going to go out to like a park or whatever. I'll, I'll find something. Maybe I'll put in a lot. You know, I wonder who's going to win this. Because honestly, like I don't know who's going to win. Like, I think it might be, I'm, okay, honestly, I am rooting for Veronica, because, like, I spent a lot of time on that intro just for her to die, no. So, I'm rooting, I'm personally rooting for Veronica, but I'm not going to force you guys to root for her, too. I mean, 
I have to give it to Ram. He's been doing really good. So Ram might just win this thing, you know? And JD, well, JD is fucking crazy. He's going to do anything to win. I just want them to have like a day out on the town or whatever. Kind of like a little break from the series. Go meet people, have fun, and then die. <laughs> so, I mean, I hope Veronica's going to win. I am rooting for her, but does that mean I think she's going to win? I don't know. She died once. She's the first character to ever die and be resurrected. So, the fact that she died can either mean two things. That she's determined, or that she's weak. <laughs> and, I don't know which one's which. Like, I don't know... I don't know. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Look, I'm just as invested in this series as, like, any other person watching it, okay? Except I'm, like, living it. <laughs> I don't really know what there is to do here, though. This is honestly kind of boring. I mean, I know we just got here and I'm not giving it a chance, but, I mean, come on. What is there to do here? There's literally nobody here, either. You know what? I I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go find a different place. I'll find something. <laughs> Maybe I'll look on the gallery. I found this like water park, and it looks pretty lit. So I'm just gonna we're just gonna go with it, even though it's like 6 a.m. But eh. <sighs> so I think like during the day I'm gonna have them like chill here, and maybe talk to people or whatever, and then like during the night I'll have them go like to a nightclub, go party, and then we'll have like the death challenge. And then after that's the finale. Wow. I mean, I would say like, wow, this happened so fast, but I just had a double death last episode. I mean, it did turn into a triple death, but I resurrected her. So <laughs> it, it, it's a double death. So it, that's why it feels like so fast, but it is kind of crazy. I think this series has been going on for like close to a month now, if I'm not mistaken. I did. I think I started it like late May and that's kind of crazy. Like, time went by so fast. And that's, then again, I did take like a little two week break. So there's that. <laughs> this series has been really fun, though. I mean, this has been like one of the most fun things I've done on my channel next to like the nutshell videos and whatnot. <laughs> it's kind of cool because I used to watch K pop do um her hunger games thing and i'm like oh man i wish i can do that but now i'm doing it so it's cool oh speaking of her she made a video where she found a mod where the sims can have like extreme violence and basically that mod i i installed it because i wanted to check it out i still have it installed you can set it up to where your sims can anonymously kill other sims right just whenever they want whenever they please and that sounds great for the Survivor Series, but I really like the challenge aspect of the Survivor Series. The, like, you know, the race to the finish kind of thing. Like, who can paint the best painting and whatnot. So I'm going to keep doing that. But I think for the finale, I might have it where the two Sims that are left are just going to have it anonymous. Like, they're just going to go head to head. Whoever kills who first. It's a violent mod, I might add. Like, people can get, like, shot and, like, stabbed. Like, it's intense. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to have, like, I'm going to build, like, a little arena on the lot. And I'm going to have it where the two Sims are, like, just locked in that, like, arena. And I'm going to have them, like, battle it out. <laughs> And I'm kind of, I'm kind of excited to see how that's going to go. I don't know. <laughs> Veronica is just swimming laps. She's preparing. She is determined. Ron JD is staring in the mirror. He's trying to hype himself up. And Ram? Snores. <laughs> Ram's trying to get that poos, darling. Wow. <laughs> Girl, I don't trust JD with the I don't trust JD with the freaking grill. He's gonna like turn it into like a bomb and like eliminate the competition. <laughs> I would show off what it what the mod is like. It's actually pretty cool, but at the same time, I don't wanna like mess with the games right now. Maybe I'll do that in like another video or something. The mod is really cool. Like you can just like 
it's really violent. <laughs> That's why I think I might do that for the finale. Instead of doing, like, one final challenge, I'm just going to have them, like, battle it out in the arena. So, JD, this is why you're going to lose. You're hungry, but you don't want to eat. What if JD poisoned the burgers? That's why he doesn't want to eat them. And now Veronica's going to eat one. <laughs> Veronica, you going to die. I thought you learned your lesson. <laughs> I think my game is broken because, like, Veronica went to go get the burger and then, like, it, it canceled on her. And I don't really see anything blocking the way. And, like, when you click on it, it says resume hamburger. Are they not cooked? I, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I might have them go out to eat or something. I don't have that restaurant, ex like, game pack or whatever. But, like, they can still go eat, whatever. I don't know. Go to a bar. I kind of wish I had... Oh, hang on. It's calling Ram. <gasps> oh god, it's Veronica, but it's the dead Veronica. <laughs> hey, I heard you became friends with Jason Dean. He's pretty cool. Oh, what does that mean? Is it an omen? Does that mean J does that mean JD's going to kill Ram? What's what is this? Oh, that's scary. Girl, that's because we. That's because I got rid of Veronica's spirit. I let that spirit into the Never World. I don't know how. I don't know how in heaven or purgatory or wherever the hell Veronica went. I don't know if they have phone service there, but what the fuck? That is that's bone chilling. That's scary. Look at the smile. She, alive Veronica and dead Veronica are teaming up against everybody. I, I, I'm calling it. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. <laughs> okay, well, they didn't really swim. Well, Veronica swam. But, like, I think I'm going to have them go to, like, a bar or something. I don't know. Just to go eat. I kind of want to do the death challenge already. But I want them to go to a nightclub, all three of them, and have fun before I do that. Because I don't want to kill them off yet. <laughs> I was going to have a tournament with the three of them where it was like <coughs> excuse me where um it was gonna be like all three of them compete and then the two losers compete like second and third place and then second place and then like the first place out of the well i don't know what i'm saying basically i was gonna have a tournament with these three but i was like you know what i kind of want them to do one last death challenge before i do that whole battle royale thing so I don't know who's going to lose that. I don't even know what I'm going to do. I just said I was going to do it. Oh, my game's freezing. <gasps> so, um... My game crashed. And I don't know if all that... I don't know if auto-saved got all that. But it's okay if they didn't. Because it's not like we did anything crazy anyway. Whatever. They went to the pool and they had like some fun, but it's not like anything crazy happened. But that sucks. <laughs> that honestly kinda sucks. I still want them to go clubbing. I you know what? I'm I might just have them go clubbing for like all day. <laughs> From five AM to like five AM. I wonder what I'm gonna do after this series. I mean after I posted the first episode, someone was like, oh my god, you should do this for all the musicals, right? Like Hamilton and stuff. I think I might do that. But I don't know. <laughs> I I don't know. I mean, it, this was really fun to do, so probably I'm going to end up doing Hamilton next. But, like, for stuff like 21 Chump Street, like, there's not even enough characters. <laughs> I might just have, like, a mini Survivor game series or something. I don't know. Whatever you guys suggest, I'll look into it. But I think Hamilton might be... If I do do this next time, like, a season two, I think Hamilton's going to be next. It would be kind of cool if I were able to do, like, up to, like, eight different, like, seasons and then have, like, an all-star kind of season. That would be really cool, but that would be a lot of work. <laughs> so we're back here. <laughs> this kind of sucks. Man... Maybe it was a good thing. Maybe it was a good thing. I don't know. 
Yeah, like we're it's like we time traveled back in time. Now Heather's back over here and everything. Fuck. Are they all tired? Are, are they tired? Do they want to go to bed or anything? Cause like, it's like four a.m. <laughs> you know what? I'll just have. I'll just have Ram like order a pizza, or something. That that'll be their celebration, not going to the pool. Cause apparently going to the pool crashes my fucking game. So. See what I didn't want: Canadian bacon, pepperoni, cheese. I I love pepperoni because I'm I'm a base. My favorite kind of pizza, honestly, is extra pepperoni with stuffed crust. Yes. <laughs> but the only place I know that does stuffed crust is Pizza Hut, and they're really pricey. So I never get stuffed crust, or I never get the luxury of eating that whenever I want, because hella expensive. Is that puddle? What the fuck? I think looking back, we made some good memories out of this series. I can't really think of those memories right now, but you know, if you bench watch this, you would know. I I think. <laughs> I tried to. I added so much stuff to this lot whenever I made the series, thinking that like they're gonna do all this stuff, but they only ever used like. Oh my God, Heather. Jeez, they only ever used like. Um, well, no, I take it back. The only things they didn't use was, like, the football thingy, this thingy, and then, like, the bonfire thing. And the piano. Well, yeah, they didn't use the piano. I don't really remember them using the piano. <laughs> I think Ram was the only one who, like, did, who used, who took advantage of, like, the, like, exercising equipment. So maybe that's why he's winning. Just saying. <laughs> I'm not going to do a reward or punishment challenge anymore. Because, like, there's only three people left. So you know what? I might just have it where they all have, like, a nice bed. And they can all sleep in here if they want. Because you know what? They're top three. Like, they made it this far. They can get the luxury. So I got blue for Veronica, red for JD, and pink for Ram, because why not? But I can't really fit Ram. I don't know if the beds can be this close or not. I don't know. <laughs> and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put Ram right here. You know what? It's it's better than what they have here, just saying, so. Heather C, where are you going? Heather C. Oh, she's going back home. She's spooky. <laughs> she wants to see the tea. Like, she wants to see what's going to happen in the top three, honestly. <laughs> the real question isn't who wins. It's where the fuck is my pepperoni pizza? Because last time I checked, we ordered it, like, forever ago. You know, I I'm just kind of upset that we never got our pizza. Oh my god, I paid top dollar for that pizza. I'm calling the police. <laughs> you know, I think one thing I don't like about The Sims 4, or that, like, one thing that I kind of miss from The Sims 3 is how the fact that there's no burglars, so there's no police. And, I mean, there is police in The Sims 4 if you get to get to work to extension pack or whatever because you can be a detective or whatnot and put people to jail. But still, I, I kind of miss having, like, burglars come in and, like, my sim can either, like, beat the heck out of them or, like, call the police. Or, like, having where you have to call the firefighters. I miss that. Like, the sims always put up the fire themselves, and that kind of sucks. <laughs> where the fuck is my fucking pizza? Do I have to order another fucking pizza? I'm gonna order another pizza. I mean, I know I can't eat the pizza because it's in the sims, but, like, I... I ordered a pizza. Pizza's already on its way. What? Where? Where? I ordered it hours ago. Hours ago. And is there a pizza? No. I feel so bad for these Sims. All I want them to do is just have fun and eat some pizza and go clubbing before they die. But no. So you know what? I'm just going to get them all high. Oh my god. He decides to come now. Smith. 
Wait, 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 wait. Let me show you guys. Let me show you guys the. Uh, let me show you guys the modern action. Okay, so you can punch Sims too. Like it's called extreme violence, and you can do stuff like stab gut, stab chest, shoot Sim. It's crazy. Steal their money. So because he's late, we're gonna punch him. And it's JD, so it's kind of fitting. Is he gonna punch him? <laughs> Jesus Christ! It's so violent. Wait, wait, no, 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 I want my pizza. <clears throat> but, like, that's what... No! No! I'm sorry I punched you. <sighs> He's running away with my pizza. That was a bad idea. <laughs> it's okay, JD. Just go get high or something. It's okay. That was kind of funny, though. <laughs> that was worth it. But that's what he gets for like being late with my pizza. Like we ordered it like a long time ago. It's probably cold. Swande Shwema. It's been our shelves. What's up with Clonor? Lushi! Jeez, Ran looks offended. What did Veronica say? <laughs> My god, the tension here is just way too much. JD's having a bad trip. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? What? What is he doing here? Oh, he's gonna rob us because we punched him? What are you doing? Why is he thinking about Veronica while staring into a corner of the house? We didn't even invite him in here. Sir, you're gonna have to leave. Here, let's just take the pizza. Before he runs off again. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't go. Don't go. Was that so hard? Oh my god, he's bleeding. His face is red. Jeez. Here, let's take his money, too. You can do that, too, with the extreme violence, and you can steal their money. It's crazy. Honestly, this mod is so fun. But I wouldn't use it, like, for, like, death challenges or anything. Like, I would just only use it for, like, little things like punches. <laughs> He's just so, like, in shock. Oh, wait, JD's gonna steal his money. Vinva. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's amazing. <gasps> hey, I heard you became friends with Jason Dean. He's pretty cool. Veronica. Oh my god. Her dead. Her ghost. She did it again. Why are you being so rude to the pizza guy? Because he was late with our motherfucking pizza. Are you gonna leave or are we gonna have to punch you again? Because I wouldn't mind punching you again. Hey, pizza guy, can you, like, go, pizza guy? Why are you still here? You know what? Punch him. Punch him. I would kill him, but, no. I don't know. I don't want him to mess with, like, their emotions. There you go, JD. Now ask him to leave politely. Bye. Flynn, crumb it. Oh. Thank you. Holy shit. That took way too much energy and way, way too much punches. Thanks for hanging out with me. That We didn't... Hey, I heard you became friends with Ram Sweeney. He's pretty cool. Dead Veronica is fucking creepy, man. Dead Veronica is fucking creepy. I'm just gonna say that now. I don't know what alive Veronica is doing, but... It's kind of scary. Uh, I'm scared. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna have them all take a nap, and then they'll be all energized for tonight because they're gonna go clubbing. For some reason, the violence mod also has a twerking aspect to it, so I'll have Veronica get a little wild at the club tonight. But 
I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why they put twerking. It is kind of funny, but like I don't, I don't really know what made them want to do like put twerking into like a mod where you can kill people. So I don't know if I ever explain this, but I'm just gonna run it down really quick. But I put like, like the way I decorated this, like I put like the like the flowers to represent like the kind of places they are. Like the last two places get like ugly potted plants, and the next two places get those flowers. And those two places get those two flowers. And then second place gets all this crap. <laughs> and then, like, of course, first place is alive. And for, like, third place, I put, like, a trophy. And then I put a trophy for second place. And then the first place trophy is that trophy. I, like, put it up. Like, I, like, you know, the first place trophy is this trophy. So, like, I don't know. I, I don't know if I ever explained that. But, like, that's what that is. <laughs> it was just a little decorating. Honestly, I wonder who's going to get first and second place. Like, I really am so curious. Actually, I might, them ha I might have them go clubbing right now. Because in sim time, it goes by so fast. And I want them to do the death challenge tonight. But I don't really know exactly what I'm going to have them do for the death challenge. Yet. I was thinking about the painting thing. Because they've been doing a lot of physical stuff. So, I don't know. I was thinking I might have it where whoever can, like, maybe craft the fastest, or whoever can, like... Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? I think I know what to do. I'm going to have three of these, and whoever stays the longest playing it wins. And whoever... Well, basically, because, like... Well, basically, because, like, if, like, one person, the first person to get out loses, and I have to kill them all. That sounds good. <laughs> I have blue for Veronica, yellow for Ram, and green for JD. And I'll do that tonight, after they get back from clubbing. Because they, they always play this. Like, all of them do. I think all of them do. So, that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Also, because, like, like I said, a lot of the challenges we've been doing is always fitness. And I think that's why Ram has been winning. So I need to even that out. Give Ram some challenge. But first, they're going to eat some pizza. And then they're going to go clubbing. And then they're going to come back. And we'll see who we have to kill off. <laughs> and I'm going to leave Anonymy on. And basically, usually I turn it off for whenever I do challenges, but I'm going to leave it on. So, because I think if I turn it off, they're going to keep playing until, like, they, like, forever. Like, I don't think they'll stop. So, I think I'm going to leave Anonymy on, and whoever just stops first loses. Because it's kind of like the Sims choice. You know what I mean? I love how Veronica has, like, a master sweet bed, yet she chooses a, <laughs> a freaking, like, wooden bench. She hard. She playing hard. She ain't playing no games. <laughs> JD's literally me with coffee and pizza looking all like... <laughs> slouched, honestly. Same. That's the most relatable thing I've ever seen in The Sims, honestly. Like, I don't usually have coffee and pizza together. I'm not saying that, but I'm just saying I love the two. I've never tried it together. Uh, <laughs> here, I'll get, I'll, I'll make them go to the karaoke bar. I've never been here. I got this extension back, and I've never like really checked it out too much. Hello, nuts and oh my god! Ram Sweeney, more like Frank Sinatra, am I right, ladies? <laughs> but really, my ears are bleeding, and I feel personally attacked. <gasps> what? What? I didn't see what Kurt said, but the fact that the fact that Ram's been getting calls from dead people recently 
I don't know if that's a good sign or a bad sign. Like, is that an omen? <laughs> is Ram Sweeney the guy that we all thought would win this series about to lose? Because, like, I mean, with that singing, I would be okay if he lost. <laughs> Veronica trying to hit some guy up. What's his name? Adisa. Gunther Minich. Oh. Nice. He's part of the Ariana Grande club. That's nice. Okay, I think the sound broke because I can't hear Ram sing or any music. So, uh, I'm not complaining. <laughs> What's Judy doing? Oh, Talk to self. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Veronica always has this like sly look to her. Like you feel like she just knows stuff. Like she just met this guy. And the way she looks, it looks like she already knows everything about him. <laughs> see? Did you see that? Did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> JD thought <laughs> Ram singing was horrible. I wonder why I can't have them all sing together. Well, you know what? I'm just going to have Veronica sing some jazz. Honestly, do you think she'll be better? I don't know. I mean, she can hit the high notes in real life, but... <sighs> Slay the scene, Veronica. Slay the scene. <laughs> God, she's like the next Hazley. I love it. <laughs> Bitch, what the fuck? <laughs> I, I gotta leave. Um, nice seeing y'all, but I'm done. I'm done. JD, what the heck? JD, you're just in time for the performance. Ram needs a drink after this. Honestly, she came back to life, but I think her vocal cords are still dead. <laughs> okay, well, I think I'm going to have them all go back home, and we're going to do the death challenge. I was going to have them go clubbing, but you know what? It's getting kind of late, and JD's already about to pass out, and Veronica and Ram are, like, decent. I don't know if I should leave JD in this condition, because, like... You know, but at the same time, the whole point of the Survivor Games is so, like, oh, wrong place. The whole point of the Survivor Games is so the Sims can, like, where do I live? Oh, I live here. So the Sims can, like, take care of their needs, and then if they're not in the best condition whenever the challenge starts, that's just what happens. But you know what? Who the heck is that? You know what? I'm just gonna have them, like, I'll make them all happy, and then I'll see what happens. Because, like, I don't want to put JD in that much of a disadvantage. Even though it was kind of his choice, still, it's because my game runs so slow and stuff. That sometimes it, like, bugs out. And, like, whenever, like, he's tired or whatever, like, he doesn't go to sleep. Who do you think's going to win? I don't know. Like, I really don't know who's going to win. Like... I'm so curious. Like, it could literally be anyone. Because it's kind of like whenever the Sims want to stop. Because they're all going to be happy. So... <laughs> I really don't know who's going to win. I mean, lose. I should say lose. Because, like... Yeah. It's just whoever stops playing first. Whoever can't take the blocks, you know? Okay, so... Turn on cheats. Make them all happy. I don't really need to make Veronica happy, but just because, you know, just make it even. And then I'm going to have them all teleport here. Here we go. Oh my god, I'm kind of nervous. Okay, I'm really nervous. I don't know who's going to win. I'm kind of scared. Oh my god, it's getting so, like, close. 
Okay. <sighs> Go. Oh my god, it froze. Okay. So there's no way to really keep count or anything. It's just whoever stops first is gonna die. Oh god. I'm kind of nervous. Well, I don't know if it's gonna be soon or not because like the game keeps kind of freezing a little bit. But. I don't know. They're all in great moods too, so it might last a while. I guess I'll kind of speed it up a little bit. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh my god. No, JD. No, JD. You can't go back in. It's too late. You lost. Oh, oh what a shocker. Okay. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I wasn't expecting Judy to lose. Honestly, I thought it was gonna be Veronica because, like, I was like, okay, I spent all this time making the fucking intro just to have Veronica die, but nope, it was JD. Wow. Okay. Well, should I have JD die the way Veronica kills? You know what? Okay, I think I'm gonna have Veronica shoot JD because, like, that's what that's how he dies in the fucking musical. So. Yeah, and then you guys can see, like, how crazy this fucking mod is. I think it's so fun. But just to make it more realistic, if it lets me, I don't know, it's kind of laggy. <laughs> so, I'm going to have, I selected that Veronica is going to shoot JD. Look how crazy this mod is. Look at this. Wait, 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 Shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, hang on. Never mind. My game is being stupid. My heart's racing. Because, like, she's going to kill JD. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm so sorry, JD. I'm so sorry. You made it so far, but you lost. And we can't bring him back because he didn't die by accident. <laughs> This is how crazy this mod is. Okay, it gets kind of violent. Just a fair warning. So, fair warning. She fucking shot him. Oh my god. And she's confident. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, who's that? Ram! Kurt! <laughs> I mean, Kurt, I'm sorry. Kurt's just like. <sighs> it's funny because in the musical, JD shot Kurt, so now Kurt's all like, bitch. <laughs> the gay dead sons over JD's shot body. It's really violent, so I'm not gonna zoom into his face, but basically, that's what the mod is. It's really violent, it's kinda cool. It's kind of a dark turn to the series. But I figure, you know, whatever. I think if I did it next season, like if I had a whole nother season, I wouldn't have it where they kill each other off like this. Or maybe I will. Depends what you guys feel like. But I figured since, you know, in the musical Veronica, well, spoiler, Veronica shoots JD. It's only, <laughs> just to make it, you know, just to do that. It's also easier on me because I don't have to type in a cheat. So Jason Dean, second place. It won't let me let go. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. Fix it. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, that intensity. Excuse me. Oh my gosh. I'm so like, I'm so shook. See, the only reason I didn't have 
the only reason that I didn't have it where like they were doing that just like randomly in public or like throughout the whole series is because like they get like moodlets from it and it might be too much of an advantage like headshot and serial killer like and then like the people who witness it are like all tense and scared so i mean i can always reset it but plus like she holds on to the gun i don't know like you can hear it and she kind of like plays around with it but eh. let me save it because just in case the game crashes it may have crashed because of the mod i don't know all i know is that <laughs> veronica just shot jd in the fucking head and now it's it's up to Veronica and Ram. And I think I'm going to record the finale right now, too. But I'm going to save it. I'm going to put it in, like, a part two. Well, you know, the next episode. Episode seven, I think. But holy shit. Holy shit. But it was, it's so, I like the mod so much, but it might be too violent for this. So I don't know. But I'm definitely going to have it where they do like a battle royale kind of thing where I'm going to build like an arena and stuff. But I'm going to save that for the next episode. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys there. <laughs> Where's the